Spiritualism versus creationism Spirit people believe that when someone dies, they become a spirit that they never wear a body, and holy person they make the claim to put the limit on us and God and all of us and his power is because of spirit that it's not real. But it couldn't be further from the truth. God created real things. Everything he created is real. Perfect order, perfect design for far a purpose. Jesus is a human alive today and God made man in his image. So Father God is alive. The Holy Spirit is a super term for the super. God connection. Outside of the Holy Spirit or Holy Ghost. In the English translation, God never uses the word spirit. Man does the word spirit is from man's perspective. It's the wrong word God one day is going to put back together all genetic material. By all the dead. And mold it better. Then before so you never get a new body. Just a healed one. But the reality. Of a human. Is beyond that of genetic material. There is a beyond the quantum level of science. A force a piece of life that passed through time. Essence is energy is super material. Connected to God in heaven. A key to another reality. While there are other keys such as prayer. Did you know? There is pieces. Of you scattered through time. You as you existed in the past in energy. There are many different things that make up you. There may even be invisible matter to this world. Or a thought matrix. In heaven. When someone dies, they go to heaven or to hell. Their life passes into another reality. But their body is still them. They just aren't awake in it. They aren't there. For humans. Yes but maybe not alien humans or others. There is a force. Outside of time. Alive like us that governs our reality. God Jesus. He is so powerful that his presence is fills our reality. Supernatural power. The devil tries to make his fake power. Unsupernormal. Projection and some people fill their mind with it called possession sickness is disorder projection God keeps a second into the future version of you ready. So you never die. But pass through time. Differently. This is known as the soul part. And it's much more complicated than what I say using man's words. Language there are many uses for the word spirit, like holiday spirit or thought one-minded celebration. Connection. These are all man's terms. Limiting or examining one word one dot in a vast part is wrong. Mark 12 30 And thou shalt love the Lord thy God with all thy heart, and with all thy soul, and with all thy mind, and with all thy strength. This is the first commandment. 1 John 4 8 He that loveth not knoweth not God. For God is love 31 and the second is like, namely this, thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. There is none other commandment greater than these. A new commandment to love one another. Jesus was saying love is great love is everything good. Abundant life. And God reaches all with his goodness. He knows what you're thinking of in heaven. Sees all. Cures all. Never has to apologize as knows who and what you're waiting for it's him where you belong. And he said Matthew 7 7 ask, and it shall be given to you seek, and ye shall find, knock, and it shall be opened unto you, that goes for every good thing even beyond these material things. Just ask. Knock seek God. Your creator. Your provider. And gift giver. The force that binds us. He is not limited to constructs of man. God is everything good. Just look at what we are made of carbon. But what kind we are different. We have God our Father material on us. Over that. Making it super carbon. Perfect. Pure. Even if heaven and earth passed away God's words our material would remain. In some form. It. Can't be recycled. Even a drop of blood. Has the life that. Because of Christ's blood over us. Remains eternal. Fixable yours. Adaptable. So when you go to heaven alive. With Jesus. Your carbon changes to a more super carbon. The closer you are to God. More pure to adapt to the environment. This is something Adam and Eve almost tried to lose by killing himself. Bringing sickness Jesus came to fix that. 
immortality perfect he will give you the fitness you want and the time to grow we are his children made by him life breathed into from him he breathed his life unto us and came to earth for us to have him his every good thing the holy spirit live inside us transformed here and now into a perfect copy of him and we can live it and yeah we have a body temperature for some parts of the body but stick your finger in ice it won't kill you don't cop out by believing only in what you see calculate the possibility of god and science of creation and it's better than chance. Chance needs a force to create, which implies the same calculation but without a process no other creation stories or religion can fill the shoes of the Creator telling you your purpose, how He made everything in our universe, with order deign for a purpose and be accurate, with real evidence even for prayer faith. Experience miracles, archaeology history, and billions of testimonies dreams visions truths in a book, codes, healing, saving power, no other offers salvation, speaks the truth about life, beat death, resurrection, and all the devil can do is make up lie theories, and censor the truth, Jesus is the resurrection and the life, the truth, the way, all other religions are full of death, Jesus is life, every good thing, it would be like people on earth hundred years from now thinking that they didn't have ancestors, building design working helping out their story, understanding God is like, he is accepting you, you had ancestors great great great, so on grandparents, it would be denying humanity, existence, and if you know science think about the science of our universe we live in our world, think how hard, it would be for stuff to happen by chance, from just some dirt and a big rock called earth let alone everything coming from nothing, without being designed, made, without a force which is God, the Genesis organization, time being created intelligent can't be made with non-intelligent materials like rocks, no living thing would exist, from separate life from only material, and life is complex and we are the highest form of life, made in God's image, we are alive, infinity can't begin even to describe everything, small microscopic or large, and or other dimensions directions doesn't begin complicated, vast design structure going on everywhere depth is unsearchable going on forever yet with God we can cross it all, God can, and said to us go do great things, make disciples the miracles to them do greater things, us and God making everything better, and designers perfecting perfection doing the impossible every day, prayer faith, that can move mountains, just believe first you must come as a little child fresh mind good mind be childlike fun loving, peaceful be born of God be good kind, friendly ready to learn new things, and to do schoolwork to look at all possibilities, fairly not retiredly, listen to Jesus and decided with every good thing, the love of Christ, use your brain to develop your own theories, information, prove them, invent, think, use your brain, and you will find God and know and find the super truth super naturally in the words of inspiration spoken by God translated to us in the Bible, don't wait, don't be afraid, it's your life, listen to the song the sound of God feel the power of God hear the voice of God the thoughts words the elements the life way truth love the greatness immortality have him be your friend he is real living in a heaven play somewhere out there he gives us a narrow path to meet him your reward is waiting for you amen it shall be so. He will make your dreams come true. Give you what you need and fill you with goodness to enjoy life. Meaning. The accomplishment. Of God. We can be heroes go make other disciples more Christ like people believing in him accept his good everything. If we had good healthy abundant life did the right things to make it happen.
People would live forever and Jesus has blessed us. We have to have faith and take it pray it over our families not like spiritualists who believe in death or atheists evolutionists or philosophers who make claims they have done great things. But it's God and Christians who need to do good things and have will do greater things. Love life. It's a treasure. Break the devil's cycle live right. Those bad people developed destruction and lie and tell you they are all that and cherry pick the science tailor it and don't see the simple things. They dream small, we dream big. God gave you an infinite mind, no limit, use it. The simple details complex confirm God and a better way. Don't be limited. It makes sense every detail. But it takes genius unharmed. None contrition from the devil. But you are smart and elite God bet on you to convert everyone in his name.